You in chat? That's beautiful. You so I'm the only mod here? That's beautiful. All I need is Nathan. Everybody else is going to be like super asleep though because this is extremely early. So I could imagine the brothers in the West Coast, they are suffering right now. Because East Coast, 9 a.m. Tony, you working right now? Wait, bro. How the hell are you working right now? Oh, well, I mean 9 a.m. A lot of jobs do open at that time. It must be super dead, dude. It must be super dead. Thank you for the resub. I appreciate it. Oh, my God. hit me. Oh, you fakey whore. Damn it. That completely fucked me up. That completely fucked me up, dude. He fakied me. I didn't think he was going to jump back. So he has like three phases then no 
So he has a three phase thing. Okay, that's good to know. Well, I got I got way farther than I did yesterday. And that was like second, third attempt of the day. <laughs> I keep forgetting that when he's in that phase, he's still he's still considered as a threat. I try to go past him so I can go behind him. Cause I I always sometimes think to myself that that he's gonna go back to the middle and and he's still not considered as like as you know. As that he'll hit me. But he can still hit me. minutes left yo chat I slept like a baby last night dude I wonder how long this presentation is gonna be I don't know why I feel like I'm gonna be disappointed Fucking gosh. It, it's over it's 28 minutes is it really that's a long time but i'm not even gonna lie to you bro uh, uh majority of that shit's gonna be filler majority of that shit's gonna be the guys walking in hey my name is insert name here i'm part of the lead development team of nintendo today we're gonna talk about jesus
There were three things falling down on me. I couldn't do anything there. You said the classic five minute intro, intro recapping all the previous generations. Facts! You said they will talk to. They'll talk about Pokemon Unite. Oh my god, they probably will. I'm gonna be like, yo, we don't give a fuck about Unite right now. We wanna hear about the other shit. We already know Unite's pay to win. Oh my god, I went right into it. I got the double. No! Oh my god, he caught me trying to mid heal. It's shit like that that fucks up my whole thing, and I was doing so well, too. I was doing so well. It's like, if I get hit by a rock, and then it leads into his shockwave, and then it leads to him jumping on me, and then I'm like, well... Back to the drawing board. You said, how long is this boss? That's actually a really good question. I hope those are his only three phases. God, fucking ground pound whore. He didn't make the noise. He didn't make the uh, noise. Because he has so much sound cues, but then he eliminates like a good portion of them in the second phase. Motion controls are what? In Pokemon? Eh, I mean, why would we need motion controls in Pokemon? Jesus. 
keep paying attention to the ball in here. Oh, 855, right. Last attempt before we do the, um, we watch the direct. Gives me an excuse to throw my Joy-Cons at the TV. I mean, true, Nintendo was kind of going hard when the Switch came out, talking about 3D motion controls, and then we got no games in regards to 3D motion controls. Motherfuckers was like, you could tell how many, um, you could tell how much cubes of ice are in this cup. Stay close to him. Oh my god, I took those hits like a dumbass. No! No! Fucking fakey king! Yo, I feel like I'm gonna defeat him next time. I just keep fucking up in the third phase. It's because he keeps jumping back, dude. And then I always think he's not gonna jump at me. Then he jumps at me. All right. I'm not, I'm not even going to make a bingo card. I remember somebody um, was talking about a bingo card um, like yesterday. Uh, I'm not even going to make a bingo card, dude. Wait. Can I increase the size of the video screen? Like, what is going on? Hello? They got the comments turned off. There's no live chat display. They know everyone's going to be pissed. Keep in mind, look at that like to dislike ratio. 19K likes, 163 dislikes. Watch that shit skyrocket towards the end of this. <clears throat> Lesso, ooh. Lesso, ooh. Uh, Sophie, thank you for the resub. I appreciate it. So what I'm hearing is that they're going to cut the Pokedex again. Bro, don't tell me you're one of them motherfuckers. Oh, the little, the little. Any second now. Give me my Battle Frontier. Bro. There be people out here that be putting their arms up in the sky talking about where's the national decks. But y'all wouldn't even complete the Pokédex. So shut your ass up. I don't want to hear nobody talking about some where's the national decks. 
Y'all don't even complete the Pokedex, y'all. Y'all. Oh, what's up, man? What's up, Owl? How you doing? I hate the song that they put in the these fucking videos. They're so fucking annoying and unesthetically pleasing to the ear. What the fuck is that shit? Who the fuck did they hire on Fiverr to make this shit? You can imagine some YouTube representative was emailing random motherfuckers on Fiverr like, like, yo, can you make a beat just so, so we can have a countdown and shit? He said, we want our Lopini hentai. You said, uh, you have closed captioning on? On what? Don't you want closed captioning? You guys love reading subs. Not, not, now you guys are not anime fans in the chat. Not, now you telling me to not have subs? Come the fuck on, dudes. <laughs> you guys love closed captioning. Okay. You said it's not even accurate, though? Hey. <clears throat> I'm sorry. I just hate the music. I, I just I just muted it. Okay. Time to get disappointed. Hello everyone. I'm Utsunomiya from the Pokemon Company. Today, I'm happy to share with you our latest updates on a number of games. First, we'd like to share some news about Pokemon's first strategic team battle game, Pokemon Unite. <laughs> you guys called it. The Nintendo They're going to talk about Unite. Game has already been released, and the release of the mobile version has now been set for September 22nd. In anticipation of the mobile version launch, pre-registration has begun today on the App Store and Google Play Store. Nintendo Switch and mobile device users can play together in Pokemon Unite. We hope as many people as possible will be able to enjoy playing it together. Players will also receive special gifts in their game. That's a cute Pikachu outfit. That's cute. For the mobile version, thanks to a special campaign happening now. We hope That's you cute. All register and look forward to the mobile release. That is a cute Pikachu outfit. Players who are quick to jump in with the Nintendo Switch version that has already been released can also receive Zera Aura's Unite license as a launch bonus. The Unite license can also be used in the mobile version by linking accounts. Oh, so you could link accounts to the mobile version. Okay, it's confirmed. And finally, I'd like to give you all a preview of some of the Pokemon that are slated to join in future updates. Oh, preview to Mamoswine? That should look kind of broken. Oh, Sylveon, that's cute. All right, so so two new additions. Look forward to more from Pokemon Unite in the future. Now, I'd like to share some news about a few of our other games. I'm gonna put the volume a bit louder. Aw, uh, ain't no way y'all talking about Pokemon Cafe. Come on. Come on now, yo. Come Yo, come on now. Oh, they really talk about the mobile game, bro. Oh. Puzzles have been refreshed with the addition of new elements with which you can mix, link, and blast puzzle icons. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I actually played this game. It's cute. I like, I like this game. It's actually fun on mobile, though. There'll be tons of Pokemon new to Pokemon Cafe Remix and new dress up options. You'll also find more ways of growing and developing your staff Pokemon, so this renewed puzzle game is sure to be something that can be enjoyed for years to come. Pokemon 
Cafe Remix will open its doors this fall. Huh? Cafe Remix? Master Sex? Oh, they talking about all the mobile games nobody already playing. Pokemon Masters EX celebrates its two-year anniversary. Dynamaxing is here. That's the Super hour I'm going at the gym arrived, seeing you. And, he's and also 18 months I've been Team financing you go if I ask, let's go. Face Eternatus in the legendary event currently underway. How did ha how did this guy get the dog? To celebrate the two-year anniversary of Pokemon Masters EX, players will get the chance to scout up to 100 sync pairs at no cost. Plus, three different legendary events are returning at once, meaning players can team up with three legendary Pokemon. N will be returning in a special outfit as part of a Masters sync pair. N and his Pokemon are able to target all opponents with their attacks. Look forward to seeing N as well as other two-year anniversary sync pairs soon. Then, starting in September, a new story arc unfolds. Villainous I feel like waking up this early was a mistake. The story takes a darker turn. You won't want to miss it. We have plenty of other events and exciting content planned as well. So come join us in celebration of this special anniversary. Also, if you log into the game after this presentation, you can receive a present of 3,000 gems as our newest campaign begins. Okay. You won't want to miss it. That's a free tenfold. Pokemon Go. You guys already talked about this, though. Pokemon Go, which is celebrating its fifth anniversary. They're literally rehashing a bunch of shit they already the said. Region appearing in the wild. We already know the this. Ultra Unlock Part 3 Sword and Shield event will begin on August 20th, 2021. We know this already. At 10 a.m. local time. Oh, Players my God, to see dude. Hulu, Squavit, and Phalanx during the event. The legendary Pokemon Zacian and Zamazenta will also be appearing in five-star raids. It seems that the sudden appearance of Pokemon originally discovered in the Galar region has something to do with the mischievous tricks of a certain mythical Pokemon. Be sure to take part in these events and discover the truth behind these curious appearances. Your You're showing us the, the hoop in the game like that shit's currently available Pokemon right now. That shit was in GoFest, bro. Get that shit out of here. We already know this. Next up. We have some news about the Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games. There you go. Get to the meat and potatoes already. Stop playing with my dick. Why is it so zoomed in? The Pokemon could follow you? They could follow you, bro? They could follow you like in like in Heart Gold So Silver. Yo? They finally did that shit. They brought it back. Punch that guy in the, in the stomach. You can put stickers on your Pokeballs. Motherfuckers out here gonna be pseudo shining. Okay, I see the drip. The drip! The chibi drip! The contest? Okay. They had a they added mini games and everything. They brought it back to underground? 
They brought it back. They didn't break it. They kept it in. Oh, and we can make secret bases. They brought it back. The underground. Wait, Pokemon are popping up in the wild? On the overworld? Wait, why were Pokemon in the overworld? Just popping up like that. Team Galactic. You hear the music? Pre-orders. Pre-orders? I'm getting that shit physically. The release of Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl is now just three months away. Let's review the main points of these revitalized games. After 15 years, Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl have been reborn into Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl. They this showed us a lot of stuff in this in thing. This region, a land rich in nature with towering Mount Coronet at its heart. As the protagonist, you'll adventure across the region, catching wild Pokemon and making new friends as you strive to complete your Pokedex. Along with your partner Pokemon, you'll overcome the gym leaders of each area and aim to become the champion. You'll also encounter traces of the Sinnoh region's myths, passed down through the generations and unravel the truth behind their mysteries. This is Professor Rowan, who entrusts you with a Pokemon. He's a famous professor researching Pokemon evolution. This is your childhood friend and rival. He hones his skills as a Pokemon trainer through your friendly rivalry. Rourke is one of the gym leaders you'll take on during your journey. He uses Rock-type Pokemon. Everywhere you look, Team Galactic is up to something. There appears to be some sort of lofty goal behind all their audacious activity. Cynthia is investigating myths about Pokemon. She's a mysterious person who shows up at many points along your journey. Gameplay features from Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl have been revamped and powered up for these new games. That's great. In the Grand Underground, you can That's participate great. in a number of activities, such as digging up fossils or creating your own secret base and decorating it with Pokemon statues. That's it, just statues? There are also places down there called Pokemon Hideaways, which didn't exist in Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl. Apparently, the Pokemon that appear in the Pokemon hideaways will change depending on which statues you have placed in your secret base. It seems that some of the Pokemon living in the Sinnoh region can only be found in this place. So be sure to fully That's fire. the Grand Underground spread out the need. That's actually fire. You can use the stickers you'll collect on your adventure to customize the effects that appear when Pokemon spring out of Pokeballs such as confetti or fireworks. By collecting stickers at various locations along your journey and decorating with them, you can make your Pokemon battles even more fun. The chibis ain't looking so bad, huh? One new the chibis ain't looking so bad, huh? Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Everyone right now like, is the ability to change your outfit. Chibis ain't looking so bad. I told y'all the chibis is fine. In 
super contest shows. You said because they clean it up. Shut your bitch ass up. The music. Shut your bitch ass up. They've been fine. They look exactly the same. A successful show. Stop changing it. Partner Pokemon to really work up the crowd. The chibis look fine from the start. I was like, just the chibis are fine. In the union room, this release allows you said nah, they HD not now. only local communication, but also online communication to interact with trainers all over the world in real time. Please enjoy battles and Pokemon. You see them frames on that trainers. chimchar? That chimchar is 60 frames. You can walk around with any of the Pokemon with, that appear in these games. With any Pokemon. Enjoy your journey through Yo, Tanga growth on my ass. I can outrun my Buizel. Encounters with all kinds of people and Pokemon and the mystery behind Sinnoh's myths await you. That's a W. This game is going to be fire. We hope you look forward to starting an exciting adventure with new gameplay features in the Sinnoh region. We nuzlocke in this shit the second the game comes out. Please wait just a bit longer for the start of your adventure. But that's not all. A special Nintendo Switch Lite Dialga and Palkia edition will also be released to celebrate the launch oh, of these games. Oh no, the scalpers. This special Nintendo Switch Lite is dressed up with art of the legendary Pokemon Dialga and Palkia bringing to mind the special Nintendo DS Lite Onyx, Dialga and Palkia edition that was released Come back on. in 2006 to align with the original game's launch. It will be available to purchase beginning November 5th, 2021. Look forward to it. That is lazy as shit. That's the exact same design that they put on the 3DS years back. And they literally copy and pasted the exact same shit onto the Nintendo Switch Lite's back. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. That's fucking lazy. Looking cool, Joker. Already looking better than Pokemon poured and peeled. Poured and peeled. That Chimchar better not be fucked up with frames. I better not see no dookie frames in this. That Chimchar better be smooth. The chimps are. What the fuck is that? That's a growling? That's a new growling. That's a that's a different version of growling. That's what kind of World War II ass? The Pokeball threw up a freaking firecracker when it caught the Pokemon. What kind of. This legit. This this some Breath of the Wild shit. What the fuck is that? Trainer of Tsushi.
okay. Okay, I'm not disappointed. Not actual gameplay footage. Wow, we got some art. Okay. January 28th. That's very soon, actually. That was the latest trailer for Pokemon Legends Arceus. Let's take a closer look at some of the elements introduced in the video. Pokemon Legends Arceus is a brand new title that opens new doors for the Pokemon series by Bro, using action Bro, this should look like RPG Ghost elements. of Tsushima, Monster Hunter Rise, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, and a Pokemon game. All at the same time. Shit almost even looked like, um... Towers over the center of the, the land. fucking the Horizon Zero Dawn, like the way she was doing the, the dodge rolls. All sides. These different areas are home to a rich variety of Pokemon ecosystems. In the future, this land of Hisui will come to be known as the Sinnoh region. You'll set out on an adventure with the goal of completing the first ever Pokedex for the Hisui region. The bustling Jubilee Village will be the base for your adventures. It's home to the Galaxy Expedition Team, made up of people from various other regions, with divisions such as the Medical Corps, the Security Corps, and the Survey Corps, which researches Pokemon. Professor Laventon's field of study is the ecology of Pokemon. He came to the Hisui region along with Pokemon That's from my mentor. various other regions. He entrusts one of these Pokemon This game ripped you. off Ghost of Tsushima. Anyway, no. can't wait the to murder the these new mons with my so bare hands. She seems to treat you harshly. Deep down, she's your biggest supporter, and she watches over your progress with care. Commander Komodo oversees the entire Galaxy team. He's a dependable leader who has earned the unwavering trust of his team members. When the commander recognizes your knack for Pokemon research, he allows you to join the team and has you work as a member of the Survey Corps. The duty of the Survey Corps is to observe and catch Pokemon to shed light on how they live. Your survey duties hold the key to unlocking the true purpose of your adventure, and in the course of your work, you'll visit various locations within the Hisui region. Your excursions outside the village will begin by preparing at a base camp. At these camps, you'll be able to prepare for your survey work by buying items or crafting new ones from basic materials. In Breath the of the Wild region, ass you'll shit! You'll be vulnerable to attacks from wild Pokemon. Take too much damage from their attacks, and you'll black out. So use caution when you're out doing your survey. You'll work. black out. When your Pokemon are hurt, you can return to a base camp to rest up and recover. Once you've completed a survey assignment, return to the village and report the results to whoever requested the job. Pokemon live all over the place. Get close to them and aim carefully, then throw a Pokeball to try to catch them. You'll find that not all species of Pokemon react the same way when they spot you. For example, some Pokemon will immediately flee so you'll want to hide in tall grass when you approach them. Aggressive Pokemon, on the other hand, may need to be weakened in battle. There are a variety of tricks to catching them all. Throw a Pokeball containing one of your own Pokemon near a wild Pokemon and a battle will begin. What the you'll hell? Find that a single Pokemon may get to act multiple times in a row, depending on its speed stat and the moves that it uses. You can also choose to have Pokemon use their moves in two different styles, Strong Style and Agile Style. Using a move in the Strong Style will increase the move's power, but the Pokemon's action speed will be lowered. Using a move in the Agile Style will decrease the move's power, but the Pokemon's action speed will be raised. You'll find the Strong Style will come in handy when you see a chance to end a battle with one powerful move while the Agile style is great for situations where acting multiple times in a row will give your battle strategy a real boost. Use these different styles as the situation demands to gain the upper hand in battle. 
When you report the results of your survey work to the professor, information will be added to the Pokedex. You can advance your research and fill in more information by doing things like catching Pokemon, seeing them use certain moves multiple times, and more. Seek out and meet lots of different Pokemon to complete that Pokedex. <coughs> now, we'd like to introduce some of the Pokemon living in the rich, natural environments that are spread out across the Hisui region. What Pokemon this is that? This Pokemon with distinctive antlers is known as Weirdeer. Weirdeer evolves from a Stantler that has managed to live in the harsh, natural environment of the Hisui region. It has strong ties with the local people, and it has been treated with great care and respect in this land since ancient times. Garments made with the fur shed from its beard, tail, and legs are highly prized as warm winter clothing. This Pokemon is Basculegion. It can swim with great power. Basculin that live in the Hisui region can evolve into this Pokemon if they become possessed by the restless souls of other Basculin in their school that have perished during their journey upstream. This Pokemon gains power from the souls possessing it, letting it swim on and on without tiring. Okay. There are also Pokemon that can be found living in this land in forms that have adapted to the environment of the Hisui region. This Pokemon with its great majestic wings is the Hisuian form of Braviary. It comes to Hisui in the winter and can imbue its screeches with psychic power to generate shockwaves. Lucario just got This fucked. Pokemon, which works with a partner, is the Hisuian form of Growlithe. It is a very wary Pokemon and appears to protect its territory. Hisuian Growlithe's soft fur is an excellent insulator, allowing it to stay active and lively even in this chilly land. Bro, the horn on its look like a hentai rock, protagonist. It breaks easily, so Hisuian Growlithe uses it only when it'll have the greatest effect. The Pokemon Arceus holds the key to this story. But what connection does it have to your adventure? We hope you look forward to finding out on the day when you can finally meet the people and Pokemon of the Hisui region for yourself. Those were our latest updates on these new entries in the Pokemon series. I'm gonna be real with y'all. I'm more excited for Diamond and Pearl than the Arceus. Pre-orders for Pokemon Legends Arceus, Pokemon Brilliant Diamond, and Pokemon Shining Pearl will become available on Nintendo eShop after this broadcast. And they said pre-order. We'd also like to announce in the that the eShop. These titles is planned to come to Pokemon Arceus, the cloud service for Nintendo Switch and compatible. They're smoking crack cocaine if you're thinking I'm getting these games digitally. Seeing the climate and how how much these fuckers in GameStop resell these games for, I'm getting all these shits physically, my guy, physically. As battles that so many of you continue to enjoy, these will take place as before in Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. We hope you all have fun participating in even more competitive play in the future. Those are all the latest updates we can share with you today. We hope you're looking forward to all the exciting Pokemon adventures to come. Where's Pokemon Sleep? Thank you all for tuning in and watching. That's it? Yup. I mean, what did you guys expect? The Smash Brothers announcement? We knew damn well what the fuck we were coming here for. We came here for this. And now... We go to sleep. We go to sleep. <sighs> you said, bro, I want to sleep with my Pokemon. Yo, you kind of sus. I just want to hit him. Midoriya! Popeye's chicken! 
Midoriya Popeye's chicken. That shit is bussin'. Thank you for the resub. I'm about to go back to sleep. Check Monkey Ball on Twitter? Nah, I'm not feeding to check out Monkey Ball on Twitter. Monkey Ball, I've already seen enough. bitch for that one. Aww. This motherfucker went off screen and then he jumped on me. That's not fair. <clears throat> you said check the pre-order bonus. Why I gotta check it? Just tell me what the pre-order bonus is. It's probably a Sonic plush. Adding Kiryu as an unlockable in Monkey Ball? That makes absolutely no sense. What? How, how would that even work? How would that even look?
You said Kiryu's from Sega, so I don't know. I mean, you know what it looks like to me? I'm going to be real with y'all. You guys probably don't want to hear it. It looks like Sega is desperate that this game sells well. Because the fact that they're putting all these collaborations in the game... Um, it's a, it's a little bit, it's a little bit like, we already know we getting Sonic. Now we getting Kiryu. Who else they gonna put in? They really want us to buy this game. Projectiles just kept on hitting me every time. You said knights? They would put in knights at this point. You said, can't you jump then dash? In what scenario? I could jump dash, but jump dashing is a bit more risky. I wanted it, the strength to protect the others. 
When I saw that knight sleeping safe in his big armored shell, it wasn't madness that drove me to it. I just wanted it. But in the end, if strength cannot save you, then what can? True. Attunement. Okay. So is he gone? Damn. I gotta go back all the way to that place and I gotta redeem these points. Um... Good thing about that fight. Oh, my God. of death hey man sometimes you got to do it to him I know it's not good but sometimes you got to die of death you know um what time is it it's 9 43 it is bitch early right now I'm about to go to the to the moth, do the attunement on my thing, and then I might end the stream. Where is the subway? What is this bug? And then I'm gonna stream later on, obviously. It's just it's early as fuck right now. Hello. Thank God I ended up beating that boss though, because I'm not gonna lie to you. When I first fought him, I was like, there's no way I'm gonna beat him. But I beat him. One of the spider people is one of the people is here. He's on the map. One of the mask face people is here. Oh shit. Nah, bro, get me out. Get me out. I'm not I'm not I, I can't fight him now. You said what a baby? You dusty bitch. I'm trying to um cash in my tokens. Pale ore. <gasps> That's the upgrade. Dream wielder. That bitch made too much noise. Nah, let's not go here. Let's upgrade our nail. We gotta upgrade the nail. 
Where is the place to upgrade the nail? Where's the nail man? They're not there. Yo, chat. The City of Tears? Is it this guy right here at the bottom? Right there? I think that is him. City of Tears. Again, my ass be at the next boss. A, hey. hey, I'm beating bosses right now, so it's not too bad. Doctor Smash, what's up, man? Thank you for the raid, man. Oh my God. Is it worth to get Hollow Knight on the Switch? Definitely. It still runs just as well. Like, if I were you, Hollow Knight on the Switch would even be... I feel like, honestly... It's gonna be better because it's portable. You get to... Fucking shit. than Sony yes just because it's portable you could take it with you you said doesn't Sony always win not this time but if Sony makes a PSP 2 you guys are in trouble stronger now the only bad thing about the switch version is that you're not gonna get this sound design right here you hear this it might sound a bit more like botched you're gonna hear it sound like Bing! a little bit but ah Ronjo Stenja yes sir not enough geo hmm Man, these bitches all dropped three cents. What is this three cents, bro? B.O. get D.O. But real talk though, when's the next Nintendo Direct? <laughs> 
September. Own a five cart. Hey, if that happens, that's gonna be very fun. When the direct happens though, I want to know how that Wario game is going to be. Hopefully it's good. Like, like the Arceus game, I'm still a little bit like, you know, on the edge about the game. Like, I'm not rushing to get the Arceus shit. Ah, Ranjo Stenja. Yes. Junsha. Garadel Akari. It should cut more efficiently. Hmm, Vendasu. I need two pieces of pale ore now. Oh my god. Two pieces. It's crazy, man. Is anybody talking about the game on Twitter? Any hot takes on Twitter? Not yet. They're saying that they said Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire is better. Hey man, that game don't got Pokemon following you. I'm just saying. This game you um you have the Pokemon following you. That was one of the things that made um Heart Gold Soul Silver Goat. The Pokemon could follow you. good he 
You see, I feel like they decided to add Pokemon following you midway development after seeing the first reaction of the game. I doubt. I feel like, isn't that a long process to make in every individual Pokemon follow you? To have a sprite for them? That's a long-ass process. I feel like that was already in the game. Did you beat the failed champion? You wouldn't know because you weren't here. So now you lost out. You lost out on the on the on the cool Tetra. stuff. Don't tell him, chat. Chat, don't tell him. Don't tell him, chat. Ain't no tell. What's in here? Oh no. Who this? Oh! That bitch kill me. That dirty bitch kill me. You said Dawn was what? I'm gonna fight that bitch again and I'm gonna fucking take her goddamn shoes. I only had like 60 bucks anyway. Ugh. You said, I'm gonna guess you didn't? Oh, yeah, keep guessing. I'm just waiting for another Senran Kagura. I'm gonna be real with you. There's no new Senran Kagura game that's gonna come out that's gonna make me even want to play it. Because every Senran Kagura game that came out, um, it looks a little bit like... They have the same character models and they look like shit. I'm tired of the character models. This is new to us. It's the first time ever in a remake that we... What? That we get to be able to change the character? Looks good. My cookies are so very tasty. How many souls are here? Can't I take all these souls? These are all bosses. God. Hmm. How many are there? Oh my God. These guys must be excruciatingly hard. My God. He looks just like me. Who the fuck?
How hard are, e are, are each of these guys excruciatingly hard? Nah, they aren't bosses. You cap it. So if I hit him with triangle, yes, I can fight him, though. Oh, this bitch gets in the way. Oh. And then she will um, insta-kill you. Okay, that makes sense. So, so is there a way to kill her? There's got to be a way to kill her. Where's my spirit at? So she's just the one that cock blocks me from everyone. So she's the one that I got to kill. Now you got to try triangle them while dodging. So I gotta defeat her. How am I gonna defeat her? She auto locks on you and slices you every time perfectly. You said dodge and get everyone. You said kill everyone except her. You don't make any sense. If I if I start. If I triangle anybody in here, she auto activates. All right. She going to hit me every time. Yeah. I have to find out a way to to do it. I'm I'm like literally trying to memorize her pattern, but Fight her. I need to have more abilities. <laughs> All right. So chat, I'll be back a little bit later on. I'm gonna relax a little bit because it's still extremely early. It looks like it's about a rain here. I'll probably start streaming around like 12 to 1 o'clock, if anything. Because I'm about to just lay down and relax. Let me see what's happening on Twitter real quick. Um, you said check the Twitter DM. I just looked at it. It's something about an Ursa Ring and Attack on Titan. What the hell? People on Twitter be fighting. Oh my god. Hold on. This guy play too much. Oh, 
got it. He might have bust his ass. It's like it's like motherfuckers be looking for ways to just hurt themselves. Like like why are you doing this? Nigga do a drop the crate. No hands, no hands though. This time you got it, you got it. We move the crate, baby. You drop the crate. No hands this time. You about to die, bro. He got it, he got it. Like nah, bro. I ain't, I ain't trying to see a titty pop out right now. Get out of here. Hey, it's a there's some good Mona. Oh my god, a, a nipple popped up on my screen, bro. It's it's literally ten o'clock in the morning and motherfuckers is horny posting. What is going on? I don't care what y'all say, bro. That's that's hentai protagonist Growlithe. Everybody on Twitter's like, oh, I think this Growlithe is so cute. Nah, bro. It's hentai protagonist Growlithe. Motherfucker was in that one hentai where they were at the carnival and everybody was putting stickers on themselves saying that they're ready to fuck. Like, anyway, chat, I'm about to go to sleep. Or I'm about to take a nap and then wake up in like an hour again because I woke up super early for this shit. I'll see you guys real soon, all right? Hasta la pasta. See you guys later. Hentai protagonist Growlithe is best Growlithe. And I'll see you guys later. Peace. Mm.